tonight we finally, finally have new Let's Character demo at like the last minute. <laughs> it's called Font of All Waters. And honestly, I'm so intrigued by Nuvolet because he's just so mysterious. And I feel like the whole Archon quest is going to be learning about him. So let's just get into it. It's about time. You call that evidence? It's not I convincing heard they were at lovers all. Turned it sounds like we're in for quite a show. It's Neither all there's that much, Mora. No way is it all clean. <laughs> oh my gosh. The court is always filled with a cacophony of voices. Passion, oh my gosh. Schadenfreude. Indignation. Terror. Emotions burst forth from the depths of the heart and surround their host like a dense fog. Mm. Judgment. This hair goes up so far. <laughs> what he deals with all the time. They say Just... let justice run down like water. Water is both the origin and the denouement. He just stopped Somewhere time? between the raucous spectacle of the court and the cold rationality of the legal code, something has gone awry. You who were born with original sin, go forth and search for the long buried truth before all is lost beneath the waves. I will use the past to judge the future. What? <laughs> what? Oh, shoot. of emotion shall flow into one. And the tumult shall give way to lasting peace. And nice. Is the God. trial over already? My dear Eudix, I must remind you, no trial can be sufficiently <laughs> dramatic if it is too short. You are right, Lady Farina. But this is not the end. Merely a prelude for what is to come. Ooh. Dang, that one, like... Wait, okay, how is it? I'll be honest, that one was, like, really all over the place. Like, even the music. Like, the music was good, but then it would cut off, and then it would switch again, and then it would go back, and then it would, you know, go back to being quiet again. And then he's like, I'll use the past to see the future. <laughs> I was like, what? So, obviously, I think this will have a lot more meaning uh, once we get there in a couple... In, or tomorrow, actually. But... Yeah, I mean, visually, the trailer was good. I just was trying to understand, like, what exactly was happening with this with the scenario. And, yeah, it pretty much kind of gives a perspective of what he goes through on a day-to-day -day basis. You know, of course, judging people and not judging people, but you know what I mean? Being the ordained, uh, you know, being, oh, I guess, yeah, being the judge, basically. Yeah, I guess, so I guess, yeah, he is judging people. But just being in the opera epic class and, you know, doing his job, right? This is what he hears all the time, you know, the gossip and the ridicule and whatnot. But yeah, I was trying to figure out what was going on here. It seemed like he stopped time and now he's saying he can use the past to see the future. So it's almost like he has control over time, I suppose. So, I, yeah, I don't know. It, there's definitely some layers here for sure. And then this scene, like, I don't know if it's just like for the visual interpretation of the, of the viewer. 
or if this is something that's actually happening. But yeah, I don't know. I, I will say like the trailer itself, once again, it just kind of teased you. You know, the music really went up, down, up, down, up, down. And it just like every time you thought it was going to stay, it would leave. There was like three like music drops in this trailer. <laughs> Three different times that the music dropped. So, pretty good, tra pretty cool trailer. Very good visuals, like this one right here. But, so let me know in the comments what you guys thought about it. And what did you get from it, exactly. Because, I'm a bit confused. <laughs> but, it was a cool trailer, though. And hopefully it'll make a lot more sense a little bit later. But, that'll do it for me. And I hope you guys have a good one. Good luck tomorrow on your wishes. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Thank you.